Brittany Griner is facing nearly a decade behind bars. A Russian court found the WNBA star guilty of drug possession and smuggling on Thursday, more than five months after she was detained on drug charges when Russian authorities allegedly found vape cartridges containing cannabis oil inside her luggage at an airport near Moscow. A judge determined that the athlete had committed the crime deliberately and sentenced her to nine years in prison and a one million ruble fine, which amounts to approximately $16,000. Justin Bieber was among the celebrities reacting to the news, writing this hurts on his Instagram story and asking for tips on how he can help. Andy Cohen tweeted, bring Britney home, and Mia Farrow called the situation heartbreaking in a passionate tweet. Griner pleaded guilty in July and was reportedly emotional when delivering an apology in court this week. ESPN reports that the basketball player's voice cracked as she acknowledged the loved ones who have supported her throughout the ordeal saying, I want to apologize to my teammates, my club, my fans, and the city of Ekaterinburg for my mistake that I made and the embarrassment that I brought on them. I want to also apologize to my parents, my siblings, the Phoenix Mercury organization back at home, the amazing women of the WNBA, and my amazing spouse back at home. Griner's attorneys were seeking an acquittal and reportedly intend to appeal, according to the New York Times. The defense team called the verdict absolutely unreasonable. U.S. President Joe Biden issued a statement to NBC News and pledged his dedication to further pursuing a potential prisoner exchange with Russia to bring Griner and fellow jailed American Paul Whelan back to the States, saying, quote, Today, American citizen Brittany Griner received a prison sentence that is one more reminder of what the world already knew. Russia is wrongfully detaining Brittany. It's unacceptable, and I call on Russia to release her immediately so she can be with her wife, loved ones, friends, and teammates. My administration will continue to work tirelessly and pursue every possible avenue to bring Brittany and Paul Whelan home safely as soon as possible. 31-year-old Griner is a two-time Olympic gold medalist and has spent the last seven winters playing in Russia, most recently for the country's team UMMC Ekaterinburg in January before a two-week break for NBC News. She is a seven-time All-Star and won the WNBA championship with the Mercury in 2014. Her current legal situation comes amid the ongoing conflict between Russia and its neighboring country of Ukraine. President Biden issued a number of sanctions against Russia earlier this year following the invasion.